Chase Hooper versus Peter Barrett. Wow, that was a great fight. Um, Peter Barrett with the leg kicks to Hooper at the first round. He was killing him. His leg was shut up and Chase Hooper is 21 years old, by the way. He's a young guy. And he reminds me of Nate Diaz with everything. It just, it just reminds me of Nate Diaz. And then the second round came and Chase Hooper got smart. He did some Imanari rolls and defended the kicks really well so he recovered in the second round and then the third round he did a very vital Eminari roll and slowly and slowly worked his way into a knee bar I think no not, not a knee bar but it was like a, I forgot what it's called I think it's a knee bar no way no ankle ankle lock right it was an ankle lock when yes oh he, did he say heel hook just wait. I want to see heel lock. Heel hook. I thought it was an ankle lock. I don't know. Kurt Angle. <laughs> anyway, Chase Hooper has a bright future, and I can't wait to see him fight next. He is 21 years old. He might actually become the youngest champion ever behind John Jones, who was 24 when he got it. And Chase Hooper has a bright future, and he has a chance to be the youngest champion ever. Reminds me of Nate Diaz and look out for Chase Hooper, a bright star and a very bright future. Just needs to work a little bit, but he's 21 years old and he's going to grow in the UFC and he's going to become a future champ. Mark my words.